All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm out here with my work van. And as you can see, these love bugs are everywhere. All over the bumper, grill, hood, fenders, mirrors, windshield, everywhere. Headlights. I'm going to show you the easiest and best way I've found to clean them. And this is within 12 hours of them getting on your vehicle. Now, the problem with the love bugs is the female and her egg sac. That's the huge splatters that you see. Now, it's not the bugs or the egg sac that turns acidic that will eat your clear coat. It is the bacteria that those eggs um, basically attract. That bacteria that goes into those eggs, the egg sac, and it rots it, and it eats it away, and that's what is creating the acidic portion that eats into your clear coat. So, got to get that stuff all fast. I know it's a pain in the butt. Nobody wants to do any work. Everybody wants to do very little effort and get a lot in return. Unfortunately, that's not how anything in life works, so you're just going to have to do a little work. But this is the easiest way that I've found. So, I have pre-diluted some antimicrobial everything cleaner from my signature series at detailjuice.com. That's a three product series, forever rinseless, antimicrobial everything cleaner, and then uh, tough tire gel. That's all you really need to do any maintenance. Anyway, so this is Amec. I put two ounces of Amec in here and I filled it up. So that's one to seven is the dilution there. Uh, what I'm gonna do first is try to get you situated where I'm not covering up anything. Uh, microphone on my phone. You're gonna soak these buggies with, you can use my infinite purpose cleaner. You can use the antimicrobial everything cleaner like I'm doing. Um, you can use uh, universal clean and prep. All of my cleaners are safe on your paint. Not gonna hurt a thing. So, you just get in here and you give it a thorough, ugh, you can start to smell these love, love bugs. They smell horrible. Um, just to let you know, we had a batch back in the day of Amec that uh, still worked properly. It just smelled bad. Um, what we, the problem was we, um, my, my mixer, so I've got my chemist and, and we have a mixer that, that mixes the uh, product. Anyway, my mixer didn't add the scent, which is banana. Uh, that has been rectified. There is currently no issue at all. It smells like banana. It is awesome. Uh, so just so you know, if you had an early uh, batch of this stuff right when it came out, uh, it was the second or third batch we, we made. Uh, it just didn't have the scent, which made it smell not amazing anyway. So that was an issue. If you remember this product from back in, you know, a few years ago when I released it, we had that one bad batch, so I hope that didn't turn you off. This is an amazing product, kills germs, all that stuff. And uh, it works really, really, really well. All right, so you see, basically doused everything down. You give it a minute, just like so. And then I've got my Karcher cube here. That's, uh, I think it's 1700 PSI, a little electric job. Um, I do want to give a shout out to All Florida Water. Um, they make these uh, tank systems for deionized water, and I've got mine all in here in the garage, all rigged up. Uh, so it's an A tank and a C tank. Uh, you can get the uh, TDS meter. Um, I obviously don't use it. You can tell better that your car is spotting up that you need to re uh, re up on the tanks than you can dealing with that light. So I don't even use it, but that's who I get my deionized water tanks from. Um, I lease these from them. So, uh, every, every few months they come out, they swap them out for me. And then I just pay them that service fee and I never have to worry about dirt and grime on the cars being rinsed off. And then everything drying on the paint like the water and whatnot, and it causing me uh, some really nasty issues. We don't have to worry about any of that. So, 
just with a little bit of pressure. You go right over it and it takes the bugs right off. Very little effort. You don't want to leave them on longer than you have to because they're going to eat into the paint and create nasty spots. They literally eat the clear coat away and the paint. It, it will eat it all the way down to bare metal and nobody liked any of that drama. I'm sure you can see how easy that comes off. If I had given them a little bit more dwell time, it probably would even be easier. But for the sake of this video, I'm just showing you what you do to get them off really quick and easy. So I'm going to go ahead now that you see what I'm doing. Um, this is a 40 degree tip and it is a little bit bigger than it should be on purpose. Uh, I wanted a little bit more water flow and less pressure out of this uh, so that I could go straight up to the, the paint just like this and not have to worry about damaging the paint. Um, if you guys are curious what tip this is, I will find the number for you. But basically, you're going to use the cleaner to break it down, and then they come off really easy. And then, like I mentioned, with the deionized water, which you can either buy a CR spotless machine for about 550 bucks, or you can call All Florida Water, and they can hook you up with a system. Uh, I'm not going to talk price, because I don't know what it costs now, and also... Um, I, well, really, I just have no clue. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get the rest of these bugs off just like you see. And then I will come back and show you the finished product. But this is the easiest way that I have found to get rid of the love bugs. And really the fastest. I mean, I'm not doing any work. I'm just holding the spray gun. All right. We'll be right back to see no more love buggies. All right, guys. That's it. So, just a little electric pressure washer. Some deionized water from All Florida Water. That's our number, 800-800-5892. And uh, that's it. Bugs come off easily. And like I said, you could use any of my cleaners. Infinite Purpose Cleaner, Antimicrobial Everything Cleaner, which is what I did here. Uh, that will help. Uh, it'll break down the bacteria and all that, but the biggest deal we're doing is just removing the bugs so that that's what matters more i just happen to have the amec just sitting around um so i hit it with the amec let it sit for a couple of minutes and then just pressure washed it off and uh, no more bugs no worry about etching looks amazing check out detailjuice.com for all your product needs and uh, check out gary dean's detail juice nation it's a group on facebook where we talk about only my products my processes and what i've got going on but that is literally the most efficient, least work, and fastest way to remove love bugs from your vehicle. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope some of you, or at least one, got some kind of benefit out of this video. Have a great day, guys.